Hi everyone and welcome to this quick and easy drawing tutorial. Today we're going to learn how to bisect a given line, bisect a given arc, bisect angles and draw parallel and perpendicular lines. A fundamental concept in both geometry and technical drawing. Whether you're a student, an artist, or just someone brushing up on math skills, understanding geometrical construction drawings is super helpful. These are drawings that will help you understand more complex drawings that we use and meet in our daily lives, like the corners of a book or the cross on a plus sign. In this tutorial, I'll walk you through step-by-step step how to draw them using a ruler, a protractor, and even a compass. So grab your tools and let's get started. Bisecting a line. Steps to bisect a line. Segment using a compass. Step 1. Place the compass on point A. Open it more than half the length of AB. Swing an arc above and below the line. Without changing the compass width, place it on point B. Draw another arc above and below the line so the two arcs intersect. Use a straight edge to draw a line through the two intersecting arcs above and below our line. This line intersects line AB at point O, the midpoint of line AB. Bisecting an arc. Using the compass, draw two arcs of equal radius. Place the compass on point A. Draw a small arc above and below the arc. Without changing the compass width, place the compass on point B, draw another arc to intersect the first. Use a straight edge to draw a line through the two intersecting arcs above and below our arc. This line intersects arc AB at point O, the midpoint of arc AB.
bisecting an angle. Steps to bisect an angle with a compass. We have a given angle, angle ABC, with vertex at point B. Place the compass point on vertex B, draw an arc that intersects both rays of the angle. Label the points of intersection as point 1 and 2. Without changing the compass width, Place the compass on point 1 and draw a small arc within the angle's interior. Repeat from point 2 with the same compass width to draw another arc. These two arcs should intersect at point 3 inside the angle. Use a straight edge to draw a line from point B through point 3. This line bisects the angle, dividing it into two equal parts. Draw parallel lines. Given a line AB, choose a point C on the line AB and draw an arc above the line. Without changing the compass width, choose a point D on the other end of our line, AB, and draw an arc. Using a straight edge, draw a line connecting the top of these two arcs. And now, this line is parallel with our line AB.
drawing perpendicular lines. To start with, let's draw a horizontal line. Let's name this line, line AB. Now from any point here, draw an arc using our compass. From this intersection, point one, draw another arc using the same compass. Now we have point two. And from point two, draw another arc, making ourselves a point three. Now from points two and three, draw intersecting arcs, forming a new point four. Lastly, to complete the drawing, draw a line from point A going to point 4. And now you have perpendicular lines. Thank you for exploring geometry, from circles to bisectors, arcs to angles. Each construction brings us closer to understanding the elegance of mathematics. Keep your compass sharp and your lines precise, because in the world of geometry, every point has a purpose. Until next time, stay curious and keep drawing.